for more on this move and what this means for the Orioles in the bullpen. Let's head over to the Masson Broadcast booth and welcome in Amber. Well, Jim, we probably won't see Jason Birkin pitch again this season. It's not just soreness in his shoulder. It's a slight tear in his labrum, and MRI revealed that today. This is a wear and tear injury. He's probably pitched with it all season long, but just recently he stopped responding to treatment. As a result, the crispness on his pitches has gone away, and they just need to rest him because it's so close to the end of the season. That's why we probably won't see him again this year. Now, Buck Showalter, though, did a great job of communicating with Jason Birkin and easing his fears about this being evaluation period that Jason Birkin will miss out on. I talked to him yesterday about it and he made that uh, point to tell me that and it you know, meant a lot to me and um, he said it's pretty obvious that Buck um, you know has a very good understanding of what this team has and he did he had a lot of, a lot of information coming in and it's good to know that he um, was aware of what happened you know in the first half and um, you know if at this point it's just a matter of I said just getting better getting physically better and, and getting ready for next year and you know coming into spring training or wherever it may be um, ready to go and and um, you know you're always trying to prove something you always have something to prove so um, knowing that Buck has an idea of what I'm, what I'm capable of is good but in the same sense you gotta um, be ready for whenever that is and, and, and improve yourself again. So after a great first half, it was clear something was wrong with Jason Birkin. In his last nine appearances, the numbers just weren't, weren't there. He has a one and two record, an ERA over seven. He's pitched 11 and two thirds innings, opponents batting 389 against him. So Jason Birkin most likely shut down for the rest of the season. He will get some rest and as he said, hopefully be ready for spring training next year, Jim. Now, Amber, whenever we hear shoulder injury and a pitcher, there's always the fear. Is there anything else below the surface there? Is this a situation that might need surgery or will the rest be all he'll need? Well, with this torn labrum, this is an injury where it's up to the pitcher to make the decision if he wants to undergo surgery. But this is a different surgery, a much more involved surgery than, say, Tommy John, where about 90, 95 percent of the pitchers will come back and pitch better afterwards. With a labrum surgery, it's much more uncertain. They say about 70 to maybe 80 percent of the pitchers will come back and pitch better. You remember Matt Albers had this decision to make in 2008. He opted not to have surgery. He opted to rehab his arm. And as a result, he's come back and been able to pitch this year effectively. So Jason Birkin told me he's actually going to talk to Matt Albers about this decision in front of him, Jim.